Hi there, my name is Derwin Bossy, and this is my co-worker, Ray Sita. We are both machinists here at the Integrated Research Machining Centre at the School of Engineering. This video is the first of a series focused on safety. So let's get started. Ask for help if you have any concerns, any question whatsoever. That's why we're here. Well, the most important thing to remember is that this facility has an automatic shutdown button that will kill the power to all the machines here in the lab. Proper safety glasses and approved footwear is required in the lab at all times. Do not operate any machinery with which you are not familiar with and trained on. Always wear safety glasses. Be sure to tie up any loose or long hair. Do not wear gloves to operate milling machines, lathes or drill presses. Long pants must be worn in the machine shop at all times. No jewelry or items that could get caught up in the machines. Tucking drawstrings that could get caught up in the machines. For rotating equipment, make sure the equipment comes to a complete stop. Always turn a machine off before walking away from it. Clean up after yourself. Put tooling back the way you found it. Wipe them down after using them. Watch for and avoid tripping and slipping hazards. In other words, wipe up spills. Take your time to complete the task properly. Pay attention to cleaning up. Loose chips are sharp and can cut easily. Support the work pieces as securely as possible. Think before you touch. There are two first aid kits outside the machinist's office. Cell phone service is limited here in the lab. There is a landline next to the machinist's office if required. No food or drink allowed in the lab. Fire extinguishers are located at each exit and above the welding machines. There are two eye wash stations and two showers located here in the lab. When alarm sounds, stop what you're doing, turn off the machines and exit the building. There are three fire exits to exit the building and the mustard station is located at the south end of the building on the grass.